have seen this. This moment. I'm sorry, my friend. This is as far as I can take you. supposed to do you have any idea what you've done what sort of power you're playing with you absorbed everything he was everything he would do you changed the weave of destiny itself because of you there are deeds he won't do children of his that won't be born victims that won't die when they were supposed to Yes, I'm aware, but there's still no telling what damage you could do if you aren't careful. You're much more dangerous than I thought. We need to get you to the Theater of Fate right away. No surprise that Niskaru found its way to this place of power. Everything about these ruins is dedicated to this room, and at the center of it all is the Destiny Stone. With it, the Fae taught the Fate Weavers the answers to the deepest mysteries of fate. Put your hands on the stone, and maybe we can find answers to your own mysteries. The Destiny Stone came apart at your touch, and all around you the tapestry of fate, unweaving itself. And there at the core was the Codex of Destiny, the wisdom that the Fae used to help the first Fate Weavers understand the nature of the Weave. Don't you see what this means? Yes, yes, it is. And from what I can tell, you're the one changing it. With every breath, you're changing how lives begin and end. The way the Codex of Destiny came to you out of the stone. That's got to mean something, too. 
But I'll be damned if I can read this thing. As dangerous as an open flame. You could help people or destroy them entirely. When you get involved, there's no grand cosmic plan. Only freedom and all the dangers that come with it. And that means I owe you a... Wait. What's that? Purge the abomination! In the name of God's law, attack! <laughs> Looks like some fun. know you're not working with the Tawatha. I don't care if you trust me. I'm much more interested in your friend here. I'm beginning to think that these Tawatha don't like you. Now why do you think that might be? After all, someone who can change the fate of the world, who wouldn't want you? I'm not sure, but they're very well informed about your location. They came straight here from Dydenhill, but they're not nearly as interesting as you. Especially now that they're dead. Now it's my turn. Why are you here? Ha! Knowing the future is for fools. Who reads the end of a book before it's time? Save your attention for the present. Like that codex you found? Our scholars thought those were all gone from the world. But you're just full of surprises. Good luck understanding it. That's fey knowledge. They don't even have a written language. The stone is simply embedded with what they know, unseeable to mortals. Normally, I'd suggest looking in Issa, but the Fae are not fond of unexpected guests. But don't look so sad. There's still hope. When you're ready, meet me at the House of Ballads. Be on your way. <laughs> 